I believe in beauty. I've seen it. It was her hair. Her pretty, blonde hair. Her eyes, too. Something about them always made me smile. It's been two months now. We'd met at a party and bonded over our mutual love of the Smashing Pumpkins and Bauhaus. <laughs> it took me a good two weeks to ask her for a date. She said we needed to talk about something. I'm breaking up with you. I'm sorry? We should see other people. Why? Because I'm not happy. Being with you does not make me happy. We had fun. You did. You never seemed to care how I was. Well, I'm, I'm sorry. And also, you never stopped calling me. Oh, well, excuse me for wanting to talk to my girlfriend. All day? What's wrong with- At five in the fucking morning? I'm sorry, I just, I miss you sometimes. <laughs> Well, you can't just call me to come cuddle you and tuck you into bed. I'm not your mom. Sorry, I... And stop fucking apologizing all of the time. It's really annoying. So... I like you, okay? I really like you. I know. But this is just... Bullshit. You, you can't be this needy. You can't hold on to someone like this. You... You don't own me. I know I don't. What can I do? Tell me what I can do and I'll... Make it better. No. It's over. Please, let me f No. I don't want you to. I need you. Do you? You keep telling me how much you like my hair, and my smile, and my taste in music, but never me. What am I to you? Sorry. I'll, I'll just go. And now he's going to do that thing where he walks away with as much self-pitying, wounded dignity as possible. As if guilt tripping could bring me back. He looked at me like I was the answer to all of his problems. Flattering, for a minute, but then a hell of a lot of pressure to put on someone. He'll tell you how important you are as a way to change the subject whenever you start to confide in him. And then you're up on that pedestal, unable to have problems of your own so he can keep that oblivious smile on his face. He wants a body pillow, not a girlfriend. A good-looking object to cuddle him until he feels better on call all day and all night. And when you do finally break it off, he'll cry and whine about how it's just that he loves you so much and he can't bear to live without you. Every fucking time. <laughs>